One of the most remarkable enigmas of our time is the legend of Fedor's sweater. Time and time again, the mystery of the sweater is something that keeps the masses in awe. Where did it come from? What are its powers? Why is it so majestic? These are things as humans, we're not evolved enough to even begin to comprehend. Instead, we must accept its preeminence and ask others how it has influenced them. There's two things in every man's life that they never forget. The first time they had sex and the first time they saw Fedor's sweater. Fedor's sweater means a lot to me. You know, I ran for a bunch of yards wearing that sweater. A lot of people don't know my secret was to have that sweater underneath my pads when I played. Man, that sweater is so nice. I give it an honorary black belt. Fedor's sweater was the beginning of Hulkamania. With all those colors in it, my dad was like, you know what, brother? I should do something amazing and copy Fedor's sweater. When I was negotiating with Fedor, he said to me, you gonna negotiate with a, with a sweater? I'm like, what do you mean I gotta negotiate with a sweater? He goes, yeah, he has his own manager. I had the chance to work out with Fedor a few years back. Yeah, Fedor didn't submit me, but that sweater was standing in the corner and it submitted me twice. You know, I, I think he wears that sweater to remind himself of all the beatings he got as a kid in school for wearing that exact same sweater. The glorious sweater of absolute victory. I've known Fedor for over 15 years now. I've been to Stereosco where he was born, and the rumor is he was swaddled in that sweater at birth. People don't understand this about stand-ups, is that we don't always consistently kill. And it took a long time for me to get good, and it wasn't until I got a replica of Fedor's sweater that my stand-up game got as good as his. About three or four years ago, I fought Quentin Jackson. I trained hard, I thought I got the decision, but they gave it to him. Now I was asking myself, why? What did I do wrong? I'm looking back at film. There it was. I saw that son of a bitch Quentin wearing that f***ing sweater. All Meryl Streep has to do is look at Fedor's sweater, and she'll know MMA is an art form. The only reason that I agreed to this fight is so I could be close to the sweater, and the winner gets to keep the sweater. It's in my contract. So, why did the glorious sweater come to fruition? Nobody knows. When Fedor's aunt knitted him the sweater on her lunch break, she had no idea the phenomenon it truly would be.